Hi, today I'm looking at games on the go. A lot like family talk and grandparent talk, it comes with cards on a metal ring. They come separately, you put the cards on yourself. These little metal rings are really handy. They'll fit onto some gear shifts and the metal part of the headrest that goes into the car seat. So you can keep them in the car for long trips, family trips, your kids get bored when you're on the way to the grocery store without games on the go. These games are good for four and up, um, but you know your kids best. So if they're fast learners or ahead of the game, then the, they should be able to follow along with these. So I just wanted to have a look at a couple of the games. This one is for four and up, it's a sharing game, and it's called Giggle Recall. Randomly pick a player to go first. That player must describe the last time they can remember when the, they laughed really hard. Tell the story, what made you laugh? Once one player is finished, the next player goes. So that one would be fun. It would probably get a lot of giggles going in the car. Let's look at another one. Um, six and up, guessing game, Master Chef. One player starts by identifying what food the group is going to make, like cookies. The next player must then state one ingredient that goes into the dish. If the ingredient fits, the next player goes. If there is a dispute regarding an ingredient, all players vote to see if it fits. A tie vote means the ingredient fits. If the ingredient does not fit, the player is out. The group continues listing ingredients until only one player remains. This player is the winner. So that one sounds pretty fun. It would get your little, one of your future chef going. <laughs> Um, eight and up, word game. Make a connection. One player starts by picking a random object like bats. The next player must then identify a related word like baseball. The next player would, could name pitcher, followed by soft drinks, and so on. If a player can't think of a related word in 10 seconds, names a word already used, or names an unrelated word, they are out. Continue making connections until only one person remains. This player is the winner and can start the next round. So as you can see, there's lots of different games, 50 of them. And they're all different. And that's what the cards look like. So it's just an explanation of the game on each card. So it's really neat. If you think your family would like this, you can head over to my bio and click shop. And you can order it online. Or you can find me on Facebook and I can help you put in an order. Bye!